Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have 3 to the power of t is equals to t to the power of 9 and we solve this problem for the values of t. So uh, here uh, I hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. Uh, and now here uh, in this method first we need to uh, move our variable terms to the right hand side and we move the uh, constant terms in the left hand side. So uh, for this we need to move this t to the right hand side and we move this 9 to the left hand side. So first we move this t to the right hand side in order to move this t to the right hand side we need to take the tth root or 1 over t power on both of the sides of this equation. So when you take power 1 over t it will be written as t to the power of 9 and its whole power is 1 over t. So here uh, we apply the exponent law. Uh, so according uh, here we apply this nice exponent law. If you have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n. So according to this exponent law, we need to multiply the exponents of these two terms and it will be written as 3 to the power of t multiplied by 1 over, two, 1 over t. In this case, we have 3 to the power of 9 multiplied by 1 over t. So this t is cancelled out by this t and we get here this is 3 and in this case, we move 1 over t inside the term and it will be written as t to the power of 1 over t and its whole exponent is 9. So here because uh, now we move our variable term to the right hand side and in the next step we need to move this constant term 9 to the left hand side. So for this we need to take the ninth root on both of the sides or we need to take the 1 over 9 power on both of the sides. So when you take 1 over 9 power on both of the sides it will be written as in this form t to the power of 1 over t and its whole power is 9 and its whole power is 1 over 9. So we again apply uh, this exponent law according to the above of exponent law we write it as so now in the next step we again um, use the exponent law in the right hand side and we multiply these two exponents and it will be written as t to the power of 1 over t and its exponent is 9 multiplied by 1 over 9. So this 9 is cancelled out by this 9 and in the left hand side we have 3 to the power of 1 over 9. So uh, now here uh, we obtain 3 to the power of 1 over 9 is equals to t to the power of 1 over t. So now you focus in the right hand side and you see here in the right hand side we have uh, uh, the exponent is the reciprocal of its base so that uh, we will just make this type of condition in the right hand side our exponent is the reciprocal of its base. So for this uh, here we need uh, to multiply and uh, divide both of these terms by 2 uh, or sorry we multiply and divide the terms in the left hand side by 3. So it will be written as 3 to the power of 3 divided by 3 and it is multiplied by 1 over 9 and it is equals to t to the power of 1 over t step uh, we move uh, this 3 inside the term and we multiply this 3 with this 9 so it will be written as 3 to the power of 3 and its whole power is 1 over 3 multiplied by 9 and in the right hand side we have t to the power of 1 over t. So uh, further in the next step uh, you see here 3 to the power of 3 is equals to 27 and its exponent is 1 over 3 times of 9 is also equals to 27 and in the right hand side we have t to the power of 1 over t. So now you see here in the left hand side our exponent is the reciprocal of its base. Similarly in the right hand side our exponent is the reciprocal its base. So this is the our uh, uh, given uh, requirement to solve or given requirement to find the value of t. So now here we need to compare both of the sides. So if you compare its basis 
uh, so we get here our t is equals to 27 and when you compare the exponents then you get here t is equals to 1 over 27 and from both of these cases you get the same value of t and that is equals to 27 okay so this is the our final answer of this problem and now here in the next step uh, we need to verify this value of t uh, so that for verification of the value of t we need to copy down the given question statement here so that given question statement is 3 to the power of t is equals to t to the power of 9 so this is now our given question statement and now we put this value of t is equals to 27 on both of the sides and we check that is both of the sides are same uh, for the value of t or not okay so we, when you put this value here it will become 3 to the power of 27 is equals to when we put this value here uh, it will become 27 to the power of 9 so here we need uh, some working uh, to make the both of the sides are same so for this uh, here we need to uh, write this 27 as 3 to the power of 3 multiplied by 9 and we cannot do any changes in the right hand side we write this in as it is here so this is 27 to the power of 9 and here we, here we use the uh, exponent law in the left hand side you know that if we have a to the power of m multiplied by n uh, it is equals to a to the power of m to the power of n it means that if you have uh, this truck in, in which you have the exponent or is product of two numbers then you move one number inside the term in this form uh, so here according to uh, this rule uh, we move this 3 inside the term and it will be written as 3 to the power of 3 and its whole exponent is 9 is equals to 27 to the power of 9. So now here uh, you very well know about that 3 to the power of 3 is equals to 27 to the power of 9 is equals to 27 to the power of 9. So you see here both of the sides are equal uh, so this means that uh, the value of t equals to 27 is satisfied this given question statement. So this shows that t equals to 27 be the uh, only one solution of uh, the given problem. Uh, so uh, this is our final answer of this question and I hope so you like this method. Uh, so if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos